Hey, all my, I wish I had an extra day in the weekend, sis admins. I'm with you. I would love an extra day in the weekend. This video, I'm going to take you through installing uh, Microsoft Edge for business. Okay. Uh, the great thing about Microsoft Edge is we've got a pre-built package for you. Let me go show you where to find that. You go to our package library, you go to filter here and type in Edge. Check it out, Microsoft Edge for Business. Now, when you highlight this, I want you to notice a couple things. One, obviously, this is what we're gonna download, but you'll also notice with most of our packages, we've got some legacy versions out there in case you need them. I just thought I'd point that out. So we'll uh, select it, we'll hit download as selected. Now, it's downloading this. You guys notice I'm downloading this as an auto deploy package, or excuse me, an auto update package. Okay, that's that blue arrow. Basically, once again, what that means is I've got my auto download set in global settings to if a new version comes out, wait seven days and then go ahead and download the new version. So that's kind of a, a nice perk. I don't have to remember to go grab the new one when it comes out. <clears throat> All right, so there's Microsoft Edge for business. Now, the best way to do this, again, I want to make sure I put it on machines that need it, one, and I don't hit machines that already have it. Because double tapping a machine is never a good thing. So if I pull up inventory and I take a look at my collection library here, you'll notice internet browsers, Chrome, Edge for Business, 13 machines have got it. All 13 of these machines have got the latest version, which is 8954, okay? I've got 38 that are not installed. Surprisingly enough, I actually need to put this on Elmer Fudd and Foghorn. So I'm gonna multi-select those, right click from inventory, go to tools and go PDQ deploy. What it's going to do is take those two machines that I want to put edge on. It's going to start the, de the uh, deploy screen process for me and allow me to choose what I want to deploy to those two machines, which in this case is edge. Give that an okay. And then notice here's my Elmer Fudd and Foghorn are both going to get Microsoft edge for business. I hit deploy now. What's happening at this point is now I'm going to connect agentlessly to those two machines. It's going to copy the install files and instructions over. It's going to walk through each of the steps, do the install, and then clean itself up. And you'll notice on Foghorn, it's on step two. Step two, which is install the 64-bit version of Edge, and it's running, which is great. And you'll notice Elmer Fudd. Apparently, Elmer Fudd is a, uh, in my case, it would be a 32-bit version of Windows. So it's installing the correct version of Edge for the correct architecture of the machine. So at this point, it's going to walk through those steps, you know, and when it's done, we should get a success back. And uh, it really truly is that simple. Uh, if you want to automate that, you need to watch, look for a video called Automating uh, uh, Third-Party Patches or automate, automating your custom packages. Those will both give you insight into how to schedule these to run automatically so that you don't have to do it. But that's it, guys. That's how you do it. Both of those were successful. I'm LexionPDQ.com. Thanks for watching.